Hey, what's up travelers? In this video, we are in Portland, Oregon. This is the land of the food truck, but in this video, we're going to the Stepping Stone Cafe to get some amazing giant pancakes. So it should be a pretty good time. Stick around and check it out. So we are at the Stepping Stone Cafe here in Portland, Oregon. This is the home of what is known as the Man Cakes. It was seen on Man vs. Food uh, way back in the day. And uh, I'm get about to order. I'm getting a stack of three plate-sized pancakes. I'm sure there's no possible way I'm going to finish it, but I just wanted to show this to you. This is one of my favorite places to come here in Portland, Oregon. Uh, I live about 90 miles north of Portland, so this is a place that I get to every once in a while, so I figured I'd show this place to you. I guess while we're waiting, I'll update everybody on the channel and everything like that, what's going on with my life. Uh, you may have heard a little bit before. So back in September of 2018, my dad passed away and that caused me to have to quit traveling for a while. I hope you enjoyed the, the Vietnam and Thailand series that just ended. So that's why I'm here in Portland. Uh, currently, I am working on settling my father's estate, which is a huge, huge, huge estate. A big, giant autograph collection. Uh, I've got to go through and get thousands of things authenticated and then put them up for sale online. I will leave a link to the eBay page where, where I'm going to be selling stuff like that. So if you, if you want celebrity autographs or anything like that, come check it out. It would definitely help me, the channel, my family out 100%. Once all of that's taken care of, I am going to be hitting the road permanently. Uh, so that's kind of exciting. Can't wait for that to happen. So I'll probably end up in Bali as a base and then use that just to kind of travel around Southeast Asia and Australia. And uh, before I get there, I may end up going somewhere down in South America for a little while, maybe even uh, down to Mexico. We'll see what happens for some reason whenever I plan on going to Mexico, I always end up having to cancel the trip. <laughs> In fact, I was supposed to go to Mexico City when my dad died, so that happened and I had to cancel that trip. Yeah, so that's an update on what's going on with the channel. Pretty soon that giant plate of pancakes is going to be here, and it's going to be a good time. Would you look at this stack of pancakes? Oh my god. Would you believe that this plate of food is only $15 United States dollars? Absolutely insanity. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of food. I mean, the thing is bigger than my head, probably about twice. <laughs> it is absolutely giant. You know, we got lots of strawberries all up here. The strawberries are cooked into the pancakes, and there's on top of the pancakes lots of whipped cream. They gave us a lot more whipped cream as well. I'll just go ahead and throw some of that on there. And let's dig in. All right. Oh, boy. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Uh, Look at that. <laughs> How's your world? 
Really hot. <laughs> so I had to break out of the artillery here. <laughs> and this is a lot of food. One bite in. Let's see if we can get a little close up of what's going on here. Oh, we lost it. <laughs> so like I said, we got strawberries just baked right into the right into the pancake. These things are just so fluffy and bouncy. And just they're the perfect pancake. Mm. In this channel, you don't really get to see a whole lot of pancakes and, and American breakfast food. Heck, even American food, because, you know, for the most part, American food doesn't excite me that much. I'm just here trying to make the best out of the situation I'm in. So, decided, let's come to the Stepping Stone Cafe and try this challenge. I know there's no chance I'm going to finish it, though. <laughs> this is a place that uh, Beard Meets Food ought to come check out. If you don't know who Beard Meets Food is, he's a he's an English YouTuber that does all the food challenges. The guy's a monster. You can eat anything. I'm sure of it. Taken like six bites, and it's like it's like almost an entire breakfast for most people. So this cafe, it's really cool. It's it's located in a residential area here in Portland, kind of off the beaten path. It's downtown, but it's not downtown. I heard about it years ago when it was on Man vs. Food, and Adam Richland came here, and I said, "Man, I gotta go try that place," and and I, and I did. And uh, usually I I only ever get a single stack, <laughs> but I figured you know making a video we'll go for all three. But yeah, like I said, fifteen dollars for a triple stack and, uh, with strawberries and whipped cream, uh, twelve without the strawberries and whipped cream, and I can't remember how much a single or a double is, but it's so affordable. I mean, in this day and age, with the inflation so high, it's amazing that you can get a meal like this for that that price. This is so much food. <laughs> I might be eating on this for a couple of days. <laughs> All right, so chances are most of my videos here when I'm in the States are going to not be as long as my usual ones. I'll try to stretch them out to about eight minutes so the AdSense people pay me. <laughs> Come check out the Stepping Stone Cafe. You're going to be glad you did. They got amazing food here. It's at a great price. I don't want to ask you to like their video or subscribe or any of that kind of crap <laughs> because, you know, I'm annoyed by it. Whenever I have to hear it all the time from every video that I watch, and I'm sure you are too. <laughs>
can get its wings. Now, I'd love to stick around and rain down blessings, but I'm kind of like the busiest messiah ever. And I need to get back to these mansions because they're definitely not going to build themselves. So you stay blessed and don't do anything I wouldn't do. Amen. Jesus. Man, this meal is so big that once I was done with it, it actually took two to-go boxes. <laughs> That's ridiculous, isn't it? And as always, eat great food.